So hi everyone. Uh, we have Sijo, and uh, he has recently cleared caps, right? And it's been a great pleasure to have you, Mr. Sijo, with us. This is uh, going to be a short interview of your experience. This will inspire a lot of people going ahead, right? Uh, as people say, it's it's pretty difficult to clear caps, but you have done it with flying colors, and hence I believe. Uh, this time it is uh, you know important that we have a quick discussion about your experiences about your preparation right and uh, so starting with mr sijo if you can just give us a one minute brief about your background so that people can know the kind of experiences that you're coming with and then we'll have other questions. yeah of course my name is sijo coming from india uh, southern part uh, especially in kerala now i am working in um, middle east uh, muscat as a retail pharmacist and a musket pharmacy around 10 years in here right now okay great so mr sijo i mean uh, when you started looking for caps what were your initial experiences and uh, you know how did you make up your mind like australia is going to be my next destination uh, what was going around in your in your mind and how did you decide that yes australia is going to be my next destination uh first i am uh, go through canada and australia in that cases canada climate condition also too much cold conditions it is not affordable for with my family is more with the small kids uh -huh. and also that's why one of the reason i i heard the canada uh, and also the extreme cold, cold conditions are we can survive there so in compared to australia the climate condition is comparatively climate uh, like that in indian climate not too much hot uh, up, uh, around 30 degrees there so i am choosing australia is a best destination for me that's why i am uh, thinking like that during starting um, before caps we all the students before starting a new course or new academy we does not know we have they are given to 100 percentage winning rate for uh, students but uh, we are um, doubt me and my wife also same field so we are talking with akram sir and uh, academically teams everything two three times our contact after that uh, we confirm uh, academically we can join because uh, i we have seen lot of youtube videos with akram sir uh, you join that after uh, joining uh, after one month Uh, get a little bit of knowledge get from there because comparatively i have not studied too much in the uh, the bee farm level whatever is in the bee compared to bee farm whatever study that we are uh, passing on the examination only and uh, academically are joining we learn too much uh, than learn from bee farm because too much things are learning from that even at usar and harika madam uh, wonderful job they have done they have molded each and every persons of the students they have molding their uh, brain how they can be can approach what are the material we need at what are the study pattern we need at which way we need to go like that he learn and we can they have route they can given to us they can convey the message case of me i to sir and uh, harika madam you a wonderful job for me you had Not any special me, plans uh, for uh, like did you discuss with any of the faculties or you did did you do any kind of special plans like any you know focusing on certain topics or maybe giving certain uh, time duration like ensuring that you put in at least 2 to 3 hours every day any strategy you know to clear the caps exam any advice that you want to uh, give to the uh, you know upcoming applicants uh, some cases in case i am also working with uh, here 9 hours duty along with the uh, home we can spend with them around 2 uh, hours minimum uh, is possible because uh, they are small small kids and uh, they have whatever the items are required in the homes they have need to purchase so around 9 uh, uh, and 11 hours finish then we need to uh, sleep in time 5 uh, or 6 hours we can be reduced apart from that time is also there in case uh, some any doubt conditions uh, we have contact with aru sir and harika madam uh, can't possible to get a leave for ex, uh, for studying any leave for studying i didn't get it from the my company so i too much struggled uh, that times uh, last month i am little struggled around 6 uh, hours need to study prepare uh, 
Mm -hmm. uh, because the job and the study together is not uh, uh, some student is not possible but uh, we have try we have hard work is required they have definitely pass okay because and, uh, uh, one more thing a lot of uh, students actually you know keep on asking me every day mm -hmm. that you know do we need to purchase any books what kind of books would you uh, recommend uh, because you know they think that you know they have invested 4 years for their b pharma all of a sudden this mm. exam is there how hard is it mm. going to be uh, what kind of materials uh, do they require anything specific that you followed nothing to no no need any book no need any book no need to academically they have provided what are the material is enough for passing the examination if too much uh, knowledge is required if, if you are purchase uh, comprehensive review pharmacy book anything we can't uh, if you are read it they have too much heavy book but have no need to keep a rank holder no need we have passed the examination well, how we can be pass what is the way of passage passing they have uh, academically show each and every persons so they have here yeah, through each topic what we needed what you no needed they have uh, eliminated what, what are the required quantity what are the topic they covered this is enough academically what they provided is enough even mock even hand out uh, even uh, uh, even any lecture class that is enough for passing the exam no need any uh, other materials is no need any resources in order right a lot of people also ask about calculations right uh, mm -hmm. yeah. so and they have a fear factor in that do you think that is honestly a fear factor for most of the people or that can be done with uh, practice uh, with the materials that we provide honestly i am telling uh, the arif sir and hari madam prepare for based upon the 10 years what are the questions are coming last academic caps examination they accordingly they are prepare for each and every persons and out wise calculation everything given only the digital is same but the calculation part the drug name only changes is occur okay. even uh, uh, our batch march examination even they can ask in sulfonamide maybe next uh, july batch they may ask instead of sulfonamide they have asked paracetamol uh, digitally same but the drug name only changes that is only occur got it but uh, just to conclude our meeting i would love to congratulate you once more and one final Thanks, comment man. from your end for the upcoming students what would you like to say and uh, do you think uh, you know academically is impacting uh, people in a positive manner or not if you can conclude and uh, you know we'll end this meeting over there with your conclusion yeah of course yes of course honestly in my with the, my bottom of heart i am telling you those persons are waiting for uh, studying for caps of sanation immediately join academically they have give a good a wonderful word for caps of sanation after passing we can go to australia so that they can given all the materials uh, even hand out lecture notes as well as mock everything they have provided that is enough for passing the examination no need to burden your uh, other resources no need to go only for whatever the their material given they have enough for passing the examination academically and honestly i am telling this is my second home they, they can given a wonderful job for for not only for me each and every one person's heart they have told that absolutely absolutely we will welcome you in australia and hope to meet you in our office in australia once you're here in australia okay thank, thank you definitely. thank definitely. you thank you so much for your time thank. and uh, thank you everyone thank you for your time thank you thanks so much welcome